SpongeBob. I need your help. Sheldon's pride would never allow him to ask, but your mischief tipped over the chum bucket and we need you to stand it back up. We already built a meticulously calculated rig, but Sheldon didn't account for his own <clears throat> slight stature. Excuse me. There are more important things than knocked over trash cans. It's not a trash can. It's a bucket. And it's Bikini Bottom's sole restaurant. I know everyone would love to be eating out of a bucket right now, but the fate of the entire universe is currently hanging in the balance. No biggie. I'm sure the universe can hang in there until we've helped a friend in need. I don't get why this doesn't work. My calculations are flawless. Maybe we can help. I don't need your help. But if you want to make up for this whole mess, I guess I would allow you to assist me. Here, use this super velocitous momentum enhancer that I invented to get the job done. Ooh, is that a bubble surfboard? Yes, but I gave it a fancy name, so I get the credit. Because it's squishy. I've never been in here before, but since the Krusty Krab is gone, I guess I have no choice. Does this place offer anything edible? Technically, yes. We citizens of Bikini Bottom must stand together in these trying times. So, let it be known that the Chum Bucket will humbly accept its role as the town's sole source of sustenance. You fools! <laughs> Plankton, I always suspected that deep down you were a contributing member of society. And don't worry, Patrick and I won't stop until we put everything back to normal, so no one has to eat at the Chum Bucket ever again! Wait, was that last part really necessary? Oh my, yes. So much pure, unadulterated jelly, so much raw power. To create your next costume. You should find it very familiar, but don't let appearances fool you. When you step through the next portal. Ooh, my karate gear. The most stylish outfit I own. Getting around will be much faster with these seahorses. Will be much bumpier too. These jelly things kind of look like something Squidward would make, right? Oh yes, I think he called them... What was the word? Art. Well, I'm gonna call them Samantha.
I bet I could take a dragon. You know, if I wanted to. Sandy came this way? She never. I have to admit, totally would have expected someone bigger for the part. But everyone seems small to me. <laughs> Sorry, am I oversharing? It's my first day, and I'm so nervous. Film starts in one minute and fifty-eight seconds. Uh, no, fifty-seven. Uh, script up. Uh, fifty. Uh, just hurry up. Statistically speaking, the director's assistants only last 0.87 days before they're let go. I need to do better. Chop, chop, this way. He isn't the patient kind, or the understanding kind, or the kind kind. I can't believe this is the leading man. Let's take some pictures to capture this train wreck. Wow, they're taking photos of us. Are we in the movie? Oh. <laughs> Do I look bloated enough? I just had myself inflated. <laughs> or I will get fired. The director is waiting for you. Huh? How did you get here so fast? She must have cut the line, Patrick. Lucky. <laughs> One big heavy jelly. As long as it stays in that cage, you'll be fine.
those cameras! And those cameras! Oh, and that guy even has a headset on! We must have traveled into the distant future! I think it's just a movie set, Pat. Unfashionably late, I see. Now get to your marks! The director is Squidward? He's got vision, SpongeBob! What squirt of an actor did those at the agency lay upon me? I promised them art, and how do they repay me? I demanded a hero, not a little yellow marshmallow. Did you shrink by spending too much time in a hot tub? <sighs> Hi, Mr. Director, sir. I'm SpongeBob. Filming starts at 9, uh, 8, uh, really soon. Can't those uncultured casting urchins comprehend that I am allowing them to be part of what is sure to be the greatest film sensation ever to hit the sea? But don't lose heart. I still have the talent to turn you into a tool of destructive beauty. Oh, goody! In the scene, you must fight your way through gang-infested city streets. And don't walk out of frame. Would you just defeat those jelly things? What squirt of an a- Hi, hi, can't am I- Oh! In the scene, you must fight your way through gang-infested city street. Would you just defeat those jelly things? Sorry, another person on the sticky smooth. What squirt of hot, hot cap up in the scene? And action! Would you just defeat those jelly things?
Camelot. Oh! In the sea. And action! indestructible magic thanks to the jelly you're collecting from my, um, our cause. Cassandra, are you sure this is the right place to find Sandy? The portal brought you right where you're supposed to be. Don't resist the Jellyverse. Instead, take it, store it, and bring it to me. Besides, the Jelly whispered that you've done some commercial work. Don't your square pants long to be in the spotlight once more? You're right! If it means saving Sandy and the world, then I'll just have to act my square heart out. Thanks, Cassandra. We're so lucky to have Cassandra helping us. What a selfless lady. to see a wimp run around, I'd be directing Wimp Racer 2, like my agent told me to. This is... But I guess I have to work with what I've got. Let's start with something simple. A karate kick!
karate kick it! Now, to really prove that you know how to embody a great hero of karate, I have prepared a little challenge for you across the roofs of the city. Now, kick down that door and get moving! I say we wah, kick things off! even spongier than usual. I hope Cassandra is right, and all this bopping around will lead us to Sandy. a lot of paparazzi hiding on this set who wish to smear the director's reputation by capturing the fishy side of his process, which obviously doesn't exist. It would be real cool if you could distract them with some of your fancy moves. I will make myself extra picturesque.
You did it, Mr. Sponge! The security guard will let you pass now. I guess some guy dealt with the paparazzi. You can pass now. Did that explosion give you a concussion? You remember to sign the waiver, right? I never thought you'd pull it off, but that was actually fantastic! I can already see the sequel. Nay, the trilogy. Let's start shooting immediately!
light, camera, sound, from the top, people, and... No problem, Sandy, but there's still a lot to make right again. See you around! I'm glad Sandy and her weird house came back, but I want my house back too! I hear you, pal. Ooh, I think Cassandra will help. Bikini Bottom has never looked better! But it's covered in mysterious cosmic jelly stuff! I meant everything around that. Cassandra, please help! We have to find my house! Without that, I'm just a common talking sponge. Sorry, Spongy, I'm just a little preoccupied fixing the fabric of the entire universe that you blew apart! Cassandra, will you please help us fix my house? Sure, right after we fix your friends, your town, the cosmic order of everything. Oh, my beautiful home! And a delicious pineapple. Here, why don't you take this cosmic costume and enter the portal? <laughs> Yo-ho! What be a pirate's favorite cheese? Oh, um, um, pimento. Arg! I was wondering about that. Yeah, I know a lot about pirates. 